versus versus who? Can we like lower the audio like on the headsets? I like can't hear anything else. Oh my god, it's so loud. Does that affect both of us or is that Oh man, okay. It's just like too loud, I can like barely hear. Oh wait, oh it's right here, I'm gonna Yeah, no, this is uh, Caleb, aka Cub, uh, for those unfamiliar. Uh, I think I've heard in the past, man, I know Zamba is definitely not fond of the Sora matchup because Sora can just do a lot of, like, uh, a lot of his combos can just kind of just kill Rob, like, very easily, like, you know, just get one hit like this, that's, you know. That would have been a stock and Rob's like super heavy, but that, oh, okay, yeah, there it is. Definitely uh, a matchup I could see Heretta getting a little frustrated in, but, you know, I would not count him out yet. Yeah, it took a while for people to, like, because everyone who played Sora either, like, they had good neutral, but they didn't lab out the combo, so it wasn't good, or, you know, they labbed out the combo, but they didn't have good neutral, so it's like, it took a while for people to, like, start actually getting good with the character. Uh, definitely high tier, at least. Like, definitely has, like, some very meta, like, relevant, like, good matchups, but, like, you know, not entirely sold yet. Yeah, probably. probably. Beretta finally able to close out the first stock, but still at a major deficit. And yeah, gotta respect all the options Sora has coming off the ledge, too. Very annoying. Yeah. Oh, drop shield too early to side B. Oh, side B? Is that gonna do it? Oh, and Beretta gonna steal that stock right there. Yeah. Let's see if he can keep the lead, though. have been like labbed out the question is can you do them in like a real bracket so I mean I could see him potentially uh, going a little like more developed like down the line but then yeah, at the same time people are probably getting better at the matchup too so you know it's okay. this has been muted the whole time <laughs> wait so have I've been, I mean, that was muted, but I think... So you're saying you were muted? I was muted, yes. Oh, <laughs> That's okay. embarrassing, ain't okay. it? <laughs> Alright, whatever, whatever. It's all good, it's all good. But yeah, man. I, I definitely... Oh, shit. That was bad. Yeah, so Should I... I... Wait, okay, I'm not. I'm not uh, yeah, that was just me. I realized when I was talking there, it wasn't, oh, it wasn't moving. Up, yeah, 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 but uh, I definitely think if people optimize uh, Rob's, like, defensive side... I oh, don't. yeah, we're talking about... I thought you were talking about Sword. Sword, I'm losing it. Oh. Okay, yeah, sorry. <laughs> if uh, people optimize... Yeah, I was uh, actually it's like muted. For I hear certain effects more. They're like, uh, like the applause and like certain uh, and like the background music are louder than like the actual like, like hits and stuff. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That might be like an in-game thing. I'm not exactly sure. I was also muted for like the first match. Yeah, like a little bit of an idiot, but it's fine. I see the Beyblade combo right there. I don't know. I mean. Like, I can't. I don't know what to say about Sora, dude. Because like he was like added so late. And, like I, I agree he should have been like the last character because he was like the most wanted. But like for the game wise, he doesn't do anything, you know? Yeah, he didn't. He definitely didn't have as big of an impact on the meta as like some of the other DLC characters. That's not necessarily a bad thing, though. I don't think every DLC character needs to be like you know Steve or like you know like a meta defining 
Kazuya or something like that. Yeah. yeah, but it's, it's just so weird. It's kind of like a, I'm trying to think of another, like Violet maybe. No, Violet was just added, didn't really do much like that. But I mean, she did when Leo played her, but then once Leo fell off, then it was really the same. Yeah, or maybe like even Banjo. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> nah, man, tweaks Banjo. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure. Yeah. I don't know why they added Banjo to the game. That man looks like a, a cereal box mascot. <laughs> but, you know, he's like fringe top tier. Yeah, that's what we just said. I was kind of muted, so you probably didn't hear it, but yeah. yeah. I just noticed, you know, as we were talking about this, uh, Red is down 3-1. Yeah, no, Caleb has been running away with this. I mean, you know, he gets one hit, and then Rob is just like stuck. Yeah, like, yeah. This, this could be, oh, yeah, Rob's a combo. Yeah, I mean. Who game one again? Oh, it was uh, Hereta, no? Well, you know, we'll see who wins after this, who, if yeah, they get up, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we're a little, uh, a little, a little messed up. Today. I didn't have an energy drink before I came yeah. here, because I'm not trying to have some uppies and downies, you know? But, uh... Oh, I don't even remember. Who won game one? <laughs> um, okay, okay, it looks so, like we're going to game three. So yeah, yeah. Cool. <laughs> not, not my, uh, not a good day for me right now. If you could pass me my little bag right there, so I get some water. Yeah. Thank you. Oh. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, what, what do you think? I feel like Caleb had like a very solid adaptation game too, and it wasn't for the fact that Hereta got like that side B cheese kill earlier, he probably would have lost game one as well. So I wouldn't be surprised if Caleb ended up taking this. But you know, it, we'll see if Hereta still has any adaptation left in the tank. Yeah, I mean, cool, but Smashville definitely an interesting uh, pick here for the stage too. Yeah, I mean, I feel like this kind of benefits uh, Sora a little bit more, don't you think? Um. I don't know. I feel like uh, Sora gets a little less space to like, or I don't know. Sora has a little less space to like run, from, like Rob, Jank, and stuff like this right here. But um, I mean, it still seems. I was gonna say relatively even, but now Hereta is starting to get a little bit of the lead here. Oh, bad DI in the fair, but still. still yeah, I mean, I just feel like that one platform makes it easier for like some characters to plank a little bit. Yeah. But so like, that's why I thought it benefits so. Like, it was low-key ready for that, man. He saw his opportunity just took it. But... I mean, Hereta's doing a good job, I guess, like, SDI'ing out of the combos. Cause, like, yeah, yeah, I mean, uh, I don't know. I feel like uh, some of the roots Caleb is going for is just, like, like you know, he was able to, like, jump out of it because it went for, like, a down tilt or something. So it's like... I'm not so sure. Yeah. We don't know what goes did, in the Did you just lose game audio? Oh, wait. I just came back. So yeah, I, I did. I was like, yeah, why did it go so like, quiet? Yeah. But uh, this is. Uh, let's just hope it doesn't happen for them on stream. That's all. Yeah. We, that's all we can pray for. But I'm surprised. Like, Coretta uh, hasn't like try to contest like the projectiles of the side B. You know, just kind of go in at the same time. Yeah, it's a bit of a commitment, but yeah. I mean, right now he's got a pretty big lead, so he doesn't really need to like take that and that back air. Now you know, game two, Caleb had a 31 stock lead, and now it's the total opposite right now. Yeah, you know, at Spoo, we call that the coffee man. Getting shitted on and then reversing this is it. The drop zone back here too. Oh, this is good. Can't uh, confirm off that either. This might. This looks like Hereta's game to run with, unless. Yeah. Uh, no. Now it's like Caleb just keeps going for hits, and then Hereta preemptively shields it. You know, Caleb's not going for like grabs or anything to like condition him to not shield. So. Oh. Oh. What a confirm. Yeah. That's gonna be it. That that self pass to himself was kind of raw. <laughs> I'm not going lie. I like that. Oh, look, it's Stefan. Oh. Yo, I saw... Dude, Shadow KO, I swear that guy, like, he'll register for anything and he just, like, never shows up. Like, I never see him. I saw uh, Mega and Death Thrasher reg, right? Even here? I know Death Thrasher was red, but then Mega was just, like, add to the bracket. I think JT, like, you know, he just... Yeah, yeah he just does it. Yeah. Because uh, I'm like, they're both in Connecticut, man. 